Hi guys, it's Stacy, and I have a layout to share with you today. I'm so excited. I love this layout, guys. I love, love, love it. I'm starting to get back into my layouts, and I'm so excited because I have tons of pictures. Tons, 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 tons. But, okay, really quickly, guys, because I don't want this video to be too long. I don't want it to take forever to upload. So, this layout was inspired by one of my sisters. Um, over on uh, Facebook, I'm in a... Um, group the secret squirrel sisterhood society a lot of talented ladies over there guys um but uh, mama tiffy is her name and i will post all of her information on the link below she posted a layout that she did and it just blew my mind it was so pretty it just i think i wrote something like my eyes are dancing or something <laughs> something silly like that it just it was just so beautiful and i'll post all of the information below so you can you can take a look at it yourself and see what I mean but this layout was um inspired by that and I am going to try not to say um anymore in this video I have a bad habit I say that you m word tons and tons of times so here goes I'm gonna try not to say it anymore okay so <laughs> this layout I use uh the recollections paper paper pad uh, floral foliage this one right here you guys can see that I hope so really fun paper pad a lot of bright colors springy butterflies really pretty paper stack so that's what I used and I kept with the blues I don't know I was just drawn to that I think um, from there we go um, I think from go ahead baby uh, mama Tiffy's uh, layout so I was just drawn to this this color. I never really worked with it before, so I was so excited. But I distressed the edges, and I inked it with the, some baby blue ink chalk I bought. Uh, it's from Martha Stewart, so it's really cool. I never knew what to use it for because I couldn't use it to stamp, so it's perfect. Now I know I'm just going to use it to distress my edges because all I have is vintage photo, so <laughs> that's what I do. I just distressed with brown but brown wouldn't have worked with this at least I don't think so so I used the uh, baby blue you probably can't see it much from this angle let me see if you guys can see I don't know can you see it probably not it's really um faint really soft and then I put some seam binding on the left hand side right here excuse my chair guys if you hear it it's rattly Let's see some seam binding really pretty seam binding that I got in one of uh, one of my boxes over on the squirrel group someone gave me a ton of seam binding I can't remember who but they dyed it so pretty and this one is like a two-tone blue I don't know if you can see it's like a two-tone blue it's so pretty and then I just put some lace on the side to um, balance it out made this cute flower out of some trim it's really dimensional there pops out I think I'm gonna put a pearl or some some kind of something in the um on the in the middle in the middle of it and I popped a um, let's see a butterfly stick pin right there and the journaling spot I just stamped a uh, journaling kind of I don't know if that's a what kind of shape that is I want to call it a maybe an ornate shape I don't know a journaling spot that I had and ink that up with the baby blue chalk ink as well and wrote a little something about my baby girl on there and this is my baby girl Jada when she was nine months old now she's six she's gonna be seven soon this is in her baptism outfit we took her to uh, JC Penny to get some pictures and she did so well she's smiling I just oh, I love this picture her eyes everything I just love it but anyway guys so and then I just put some lace on top right here and then I put the word sweet and I got these letters from I want to say either QVC or HSN several 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 years ago and I've had them all this time because I just really didn't know what to do with them and now I know <laughs> I'm gonna put them all on layouts and cards and stuff like that um, so it's gonna be so much fun to start using them but Really quick, the company is Lil Davis Designs. There, there's no focus on this camera, not that I know of. I, I have no clue how to use it yet. I'm still new at this, but 
See the letters come like that. This one says love. It's vintage words, uh, large words. That's what it says. So that's one, one example. And let's see, here's another one. This one says baby. So I'm going to be making a lot of layouts. That's my goal for the summer. I really am. This one says road trip. I cannot wait to use that one. And here are the small, the small ones. And this is the, the, the sweet, the word sweet came from a stack like this. So that's that guys. And then I just put tons and tons and tons of flowers on the side. Let's see. It's a glare. I don't know if you guys can see. I'm so sorry. Is that a little better? Okay. I just put tons of flowers on the side right here. And then on the top left right there and these are just all flowers I had in my stash I stuck a doily behind the picture I also inked that up with the um the light blue chalk and this guys is my new fun little um embellishment that I make oh and I put some trim on the bottom too to balance it out so I hope you guys can see that it's a really big length well it's 12 by 12 and I can't get it all in frame at least I don't know how to get it all in cream. Okay, so like I said, this little embellishment that I made, and I put kind of at the bottom of the picture right here. I love making these guys, and it's really simple. All I do is I take the, um, what is it, the mini, cheer, the mini teardrop gems, and these are them. Get them from Michaels. I have them in cream, and I also have them in uh, hot pink. But all I do is I take... I use four of them and I just put the points together kind of like let's see kind of like this I just put the points together to make uh, a shape I guess of a flower you can make it of a butterfly kind of like kind of like this where's my hand I don't know if you guys can see that but kind of like that and then I just put a, a um what do you call it um like, how come I can't think of the word? Oh, my goodness. <laughs> I can't think of the word. But one of these, something like this. I just put that in the middle. What are these? I can't think. <laughs> bling, bling. Bling? Okay, yeah. Sorry, guys. And that's it. So that's my layout, guys. I hope you like it. Please leave me some comments. I love to read them. And... Let's see. I think that's it, guys. Alrighty. Thank you for watching and have a blessed day. Bye-bye.